Hello and welcome back. So we finished our investigation and seems like no one did it. So who is behind at the mayor's abduction? I suppose we're gonna find out. But yeah, first we got something to do. Uh, I suppose we still ha have to be cops uh, and the snake leveled up. Uh, we got a uh, vicious bite. Torque rears up and swiftly strikes an adjacent target with devastating bite, dealing major damage and applying poison. Free turn cooldown. That seems okay. But it's adjacent target. So this is a melee attack that poisons. And But it says devastating. So at least it should do something, I, gu I guess. It's, it's still... I'm not super sold on it. <sighs> oh, new supply item, Overdrive Serum, Hellweave, and Regen Regen Weave. Sacred Core stuff, Dragon Rounds, Bubble Grenades, Bubble Weave, Kinetic Screen. Well done. So, how does it look like here? Overdrive Serum uh, grants a significant boost to mobility and a an agent on Overdrive Serum gains free armor. Overdrive Serum also makes the agent temporarily immune to negative mental effects like panic and mi mind control. So this is garbage. What else? Reflects 2 to 4 damage to any melee, <laughs> enemy melee attackers. Wow. This redefines really garbage. Regenerate 2 health each turn. Hmm. This is okay. Unavailable to Sentinel? Okay, fair enough. This is interesting. Because our current gear allows us to rarely get hit. Less often get hit. I mean, no, yeah, that, that, that too, and get hit for less. And because of the armor, it, it matters even we get hit for even less but this would help us heal the thing with this this is very effective if you shuffle your pawns around so you go in you get hit for like six damage then you get out and you just keep healing and healing and healing and and for that it's good but for getting bursted down this does absolutely nothing And look at that, we might need some money. Okay, let's buy two of these. Just, 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 just for some sake of variety. And, uh... Dragon rounds. Let's do incendiary grenade. Huh. <laughs> Look at that, the Baldies are researching now. I'm sorry, Baldies, but... <sighs> you guys are kind of bad. He's doing the legwork. <laughs> Why? Do we take Virgin a mission? I guess we do. Your latest investigation turned up no link to Mayor Nightingale's death. Yeah. But we found more signs of external backing. Atlas was connected to each of these groups. Why? What did they have to gain? That's it. If the progeny couldn't possibly force a psionic evolution, why would Atlas back their flawed tech? Gray Phoenix wanted nothing more than to leave. What would Atlas get with an absent ally? And Sacred Coil? Did Atlas truly need fanatic advent holdouts with a busted psionic gate? There's something we're missing. Director, you need to see this. Unknown assailants have overrun the City Council's emergency session. The following footage may be alarming to watch. Our response must be unanimous. This is beyond politics. It's about stability. Do you think it's Atlas? It's an attack on City Hall. That's all that matters. Chimera Squad, head out. Oh, come on. 
I'm not showing up unless it's Atlas. Do you think I'm just a total scrub who's gonna show up for crap like that? No. I only go for important stuff. First of all, uh, apparently, the... No! No! Oh yeah, of course. First we go to the black market, like, come on. Like, we got some prior trees over here. What is this? Invasion air shotgun? Okay, a plasma grenade. Let's buy that. I got some priorities, okay? Now, what do we do? I, I bought the Re Regen Vive. <laughs> Will he s sit out the end of the game? <laughs> Just because he's doing like work. <laughs> oh my god. Well, Blue Butt. Well, Blue Butt is, uh, well, is busy, okay? He's doing leg work. Uh, maybe tomorrow. Try him tomorrow. Tomorrow, I think he's gonna be free. But but today, uh, it's gonna be leg work. It was it was uh, the case yesterday and the day before that as well. But tomorrow, I, I think he's gonna be uh, ready. But today, we're just uh, taking the snake. We're definitely not taking these guys. Uh, we're definitely not taking her. So, <laughs> that is the group uh, we're taking. <laughs> Okay, send the APC. Very difficult. I don't know about that. So, we're not taking the bubble weave. This is crap. We will take the regen weave. I kind of like that. And flash bomb. I like the caustic rounds. Acid grenade is top tier. So many nano medikits. Must have found them. Extra damage against robots. <laughs> yeah. Shock grenade. Robotic damage too. Range. Wait. What, what's the range of this thing? It's massive. Okay, so this is just the stun robots grenade. And this is like only good against robots. Uh, <clears throat> I mean, I could see one player running around with a blue screen rounds. Especially if you don't have a better option. Uh, but she's gonna be more versatile. That seems okay. Verge. <laughs> That's garbage. So, I guess you're gonna uh, use the blue screen rounds. And we have a flashbang grenade. And the plasma grenade is ridiculously good. Motile inducer is, is top tier. AP rounds is top tier. Although, we don't necessarily need the AP rounds, but I, I think it's still okay. Terminal is going with Trank Rounds, which is uh, very questionable at this point of the game. We can have Tracer Rounds, Incendiary Grenade. Let's do Tracer Rounds. I got top tier grenades, but we can't take two kinds of grenades, unfortunately. I would love to, but we can't. What can we take? We can take the kinetic screen or the nano map kit. Actually, no. We can also take the motile inducer, right? Oh, that's better. And now Torque can cr take a grenade. Something that doesn't suck. It's not gonna be the shock grenade because that sucks. I guess we gotta take a flashbang.
I'm thinking, how should I do this? Dork might get hit a lot. He's the dedicated tank. And Terminal basically never gets hit. Verge shouldn't get hit. Actually, he has heals too. He has self heals already. So I'm gonna give Terminal... The Regen Vive. I, I'm bringing both, uh, just to see how it works out. And um, let's go. Agent synergies can be important. Do I have any of that? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh, we didn't show up. Unknown hostile swarming City Hall. The protective detail was... Well, they were completely overwhelmed. We have little time. Actually, it would be cool. Maybe the game gets even even harder and harder. Now, instead of like dealing with one group at a time, we have to deal with like a, everybody. Like you, you just can't have like a like patchwork necessarily. Enemies are harder to hit. I don't like that. That that's one thing I actually care about. Encounter one out of three. No, oh, just just breach fire. Okay, let's go. We shall move in. Breaching now. Throwing grenade. Okay. Paladin, Paladin. Not cool, bro. Let's take out the Cobra. No, it's not gonna work. Still want to take out the Cobra. They're all surprised. Just some regular troopers. Paladin, miles away. Deal with this hitman. And hit the, hit the guy who's already wounded. If you can actually find them. Alright. We're a little bit spread out. Not quite how I like it. Whoa. We got a bomber over there. a lot of enemies. <laughs> There's no way we can kill any of these, right? I'm trying to see if it's possible. Who can I make mad? Going for a big shot. Maybe this guy. Oh, that's pretty limited. Maybe this paladin. Go on. Lash out. 
Advise us some time. Now, his damage is not high, but it could be enough. It is not enough. Okay, we're not gonna take that shot. I would like to take out the Cobra. Okay, then. So apparently, we have three actions here. That will not kill him. Wait, we only have... This will end the turn? How? Did I misread it? Um, we have one action instead? That certainly sucks. Moving. Oh, well, that's just an extra action. Our turn will come later. Rolling. Target weapon in sight. Weapon is not disabled. I suppose. Okay. So a Cobra is about to come. Oh, he's miles away. A Trooper, the same. I think I'm just gonna stay and take the shots I, I can. Oh, come on. I'm not really positioning that much. I'm just sitting in the cover that I started and try to dish out the max damage. Okay, immune to poison. I suppose pulling in people makes more sense with the vicious bite. Poison spat. Okay. The problem is these guys all need to be killed. Wait. All need to be killed uh, with two actions. Okay, let's look at my shot first. We have a really good shot on the Cobra. But that's it. And I can just, uh... This trooper doesn't seem to care about the poison. That's the concern here. Maybe I should have went for the healing the poison, because... Um, the armor one never, never comes in handy. A lot of people. In this situation, the regen weave is certainly great. Does it work? Hmm. Giving virgin action. Best shot is the Cobra. Doesn't surprise me. I'm not sure if I want to heal for two. Also, Patchwork might not even see anyone. 
If I just go with one action, then might as well give it to the Cobra. Okay. That's good. Because we are planning on shooting the Cobra anyway. Heading over. They're so damn far away. Wow, one damage. Good job, sniper. Trooper miles away. Hitman. That might die. Let's see our chances to hit. The Paladin is somewhat exposed. I can only drive the Hitman insane. Show Let's them see if, how uh, it feel. has a. A favorable outcome. At least the bomber gets it, right? Interesting choice. I can't stop that. I'm gonna save my flashbang. That, that's the only cancel we got. And it, this is a free, free part encounter. <sighs> yeah, I guess we're going for a heal. Maybe the regen weave on everybody is the way to go. Disabling target weapon. That's a pretty bad overwatch. Uh, not stasis field. I, I guess there are no robots here. Chaining Jolt. Wait, what? So that Paladin is a very juicy target. We can only shoot at two people. Okay. I'll take these shots. What? Having an issue. Okay, we're back. So apparently uh, the game crashed. It did happen once before, but uh, that was in the menu. So, but I guess it can happen in mission two. Not a big deal. Actually, this is just the auto save. I, I didn't replay anything at all. Like the game makes a save after every move. So, hell yeah. Uh, I'm super happy that I didn't choose like Iron Man. I'm stupid mode because basically we are playing Iron Man <laughs> Actually the only time I reloaded I, I have to admit I did reload I think twice in this game twice not in action I reloaded when I wanted to put in uh, people in the I don't know the item making uh, menu and I accidentally replaced the one that was already making an item, therefore invalidating the entire progress. And I'm like, ah, rah, rah, rah. no, I'm not having that. So that was the only two times I reloaded. But that I, only only reason I did that because that was because of the UI. Whatever. <laughs> I'll just take out this hitman. Good to go. It's always a, a dilemma when the game is just too hard, I, I suppose. And like, oh, oh, what do I start doing? Do I start like cheesing the 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 the, the saves, or do I restart? Do I just like, oh, say I like, oh, oh, I guess that's this is over now because in XCOM it can definitely happen. Or like the harder strategy games, like losing is part of the is the experience if you are not not prepared. I suppose I was prepared this time. Seems like they played it safe with the difficulty. How strong is the the fang? The 
Paladin is miles away. Can I take a shot at him? That ground. should be an okay way to take a shot. I want the paladin dead. No! I should have shot the truck. Terminal is no longer poisoned. That's good. Go for heal. I should I Let's should go for like side. this regen thingy for I everybody for because this. this is pretty damn good. Ah uh, yeah, I don't know. I just want to move away. Bothered. Do something while I'm doing that. Grenade. No. Oh, at least he was nice. George can move away. Oh! You fucked up big time. I am in imminent danger. I see that. But that guy is so dead. Well. Not necessarily, but hopefully. Well, we have to move, obviously. Moving quickly. That's a good cover. Uh, he's, he dies to the poison. We are not gonna shoot at the bomber. We can shoot at the trooper. Shoot at the paladin! Oh my god. The bomber died, right? Exterminating. The paladins are just stupid. <laughs> oh. Only one trooper? Yeah, but I can't see him. Okay, let's get close. Actually, two troopers. I'm not sure where's the second one. They're very close to each other. Mm. Not enough ammo. Well, there's still one ammo. It's a four to five, not guaranteed. How good is this Venom Fang? It's 5 damage, plus we poison him for 2, so this is like a... Actually, the, the hit chance is not great, and ends the turn. Compare that to the weapon. 100%, 5 to 7, so this is just better. And we can crit too. And shed armor. That's kind of the problem, when, when the abilities are just... It, it's not even worth to use the abilities. That That's kind of lame. Need a little help? Keep that robot away from me. And that's not like some any random level 1 ability, but he just got it. It's completely useless. To be fair, maybe if I, I got it earlier in the campaign, it would be okay. And if I'm out of ammo, maybe it's gonna be used, but still, super situational. That's kind of the style of Torque. So, some abilities scale really well. Security like, uh, cameras are locked down. I have no eyes inside. There's more gunfire in the council chambers. Hurry. 
like the ones Terminal has, like giving one action, amazing. Or healing. Healing people start out strong, and now that uh, my, my guys stay up for longer, that 4 heal is still pretty relevant, because oftentimes that uh, that's just worth more. First unit through this entrance will be rooted for one round. Why not go here? Last unit through this entrance will receive an extra action point. Last unit entering here get 25 defense for one round. Okay. Not enough charges. I don't need the heals. Yeah, I don't want to use the holo scanner. We gotta use it for the last one. Move in now. Wow, pretty bad area to attack. Yeah, these are a little lame. Brute. A guardian is annoying. Another guardian is also annoying. But this one is alert. There's a good chance that this guardian will put shield on everybody. Okay. The guardian guy needs to go down. The bruiser is kind of irrelevant. Okay. Kill the guardian. Once we have that... Now we can go for a juicy hit. Do I care about the brute? The, the chance to hit on the brute is not the best. So I suppose we're going for a good chance to hit. Although this guy can be focused too. He's a little bit to the side. Uh, let's just go for someone who has... Wait. Hitman. We can kill that brute. I like killing the Brute, because he has a high ground advantage against me. Yeah, we need to... I, oh, actually, this is not complete garbage. I just realized. But will end the turn. The only problem with it that it it ends the turn always, but at least you don't have to be uh, triggering it from melee range. But it's still pretty much garbage because it ends the turn. Okay, then. Do we have a finisher here? Can we kill anyone? Especially those who are about to come now. This guardian is the most annoying one. If he had the reflect sight, not a problem. Torque really needs a reflect sight, but even then, you can just like shoot twice, and that's better. And I was offered one in the game. Uh, one more. I was grand total offered two. And I wish I had another one. Wish I had... Yeah, right now. It would help a lot. Guardian. Dateman is very exposed. What? Oh man. Go on, take a deep breath.
Heading there. Did he hit anyone? A racing target. Doesn't look like it. So patchwork. Can kill the hitman. That's just about to come. But also in slight cover. No. Now we can change the strategy. Because we can't kill the hitman in time. Should we kill the bruiser? Or maybe the the brute? I shoot at the brute. Tracking target weapon. Okay. We have a good shot on the brute. What if I made the brute also shoot down? Enemies all around you. It might be the guardian. He shoots out. Yeah, looks like it. Okay. Just finish off the brute. Moving. Containing target. Yeah, but they are just they just do nothing. They're completely pointless. Now the guardian. Not completely pointless. Let's give an action to patchwork. What are you doing? She's broken. What? This guardian is so tricky. Can we kill him? Not the best. Let's take the shot. That's it. The Guardian acts next. If we do a vicious bite, he will die for sure. If I do an uh, attack, he might not die. Feel that in your veins? that you're using the vicious bite guaranteed seven damage in formation okay if she had a better gun then yeah I suppose we can still use the ability but it's not great hitman our chance to hit is just so ridiculously high. <laughs> so, why do you even bother moving or flanking? Just just hit every time. Okay. Let's send in the robot. Zapping the target. Next time just shoot. It's a little pointless. <laughs> These guys won't do anything. No! Oh, look at that. And this is why Cherub sucks. He's like 
these guys. Erasing target. Nice. If they don't miss, they do bomb damage, which gets auto healed. Wait, does anyone need a heal? Obviously not. gonna hit me now this is the time he's gonna do one damage oh no he did three damage well, what are we gonna do let's all watch on him covering the squad everybody this guy is a danger I will fire if they reposition Smart thinking. Oh. He'll be fine. <laughs> she almost has so many max HP already. Oh, just finish him off. Okay then. They didn't exactly send the A team to take over the city hall. So I'm thinking this might be a distraction. Can hear me? Deputy Mayor, what's your status? I made it to a panic room, but they're trying to break in. Stay put. We're outside the council chambers. Yeah, you have nothing to worry about. Who cares about that? All units through this entrance get 50 dodge. That's good. Let's go. Alright. Breaching now. Good luck, mates, inside. Throwing grenade. Okay, there's more red. A necromancer. That's pretty much uh, pointless. The mech is annoying. We got double mech here. A bomber is annoying. Heat mid is kind of pointless. Wow, we got a bomber up close. I think I will intentionally ignore the necromancer. And go for mechs. And maybe bombers. I think we gotta go double mech. Because those things are very easy to hit. I suppose we got a very easy bomber too. There's a bomber hiding next to us. Okay. Hit it hit the side mech. Mm, not you. Hit the side mech. Oh, actually, I forgot that he has the anti-robot rounds. <laughs> right. Okay, let's go after the bomber. We got poison. <clears throat> We're here for that target. <sighs> Don't worry, Mayor, Deputy Mayor. Uh, we are on the case. So, two necromancers. Uh, let's just let them do something dumb. Uh, we can do poison spit on at least one hitman, I guess. And there's a bomber up close, which is a concern, but uh, I guess he's gonna come last. Uh, can I just spit over here? Oh, I can't target two people. A 
a steam up terminal. Poison spit. Hmm. I guess I'm this guy. You may feel a slight sting. Yeah, I want to take out the Mac. It takes two shots anyway. Okay. Motile Inducer. I can give Patchwork stupid amounts of action points. You can also throw a plasma grenade. Just to strip the armor. And the cover. Throw of the plasma. bomber. I'll just give her one action point for now. And let's see what she does with it. We can not do that. That seems okay. No! Oh! I was just looking at him. I wasn't serious. Set him up, you knock him down. Okay, let's take out the bomber. I don't care about the hitmans or the necromancers. I was also. Playing on a chain shot. <sighs> Is that guaranteed? Not exactly guaranteed, just very likely. He has acid, so he will die. No! Free shot! Well, he's dead next turn. <laughs> Does he have a zombie? Maybe he's gonna resurrect two zombies. And then... Die automatically. Losing the zombies. Good job. Okay, Verge. The mech is about to act. Oh, we can't... Can't reach Necromancer. That's a little annoying. He will hit his own zombies. What if I make the uh, Necromancer fall asleep? I don't think that's gonna disrupt the zombies, right? No, it doesn't. Take out the mech, that's for sure. The Twitch heals because of it. These spectral zombies will hit me if I leave them here. What can we hit? What? I only see spectral zombies? No, 
Now we see the Necromancer, although... It's not as easy to hit. Let's take the shot. Okay. He's gonna die to poison. Like the other one. Hitman, can you do something? Ooh, watching. This Double guy is time. dying to poison. This Hitman's never seemed to do anything. These zombies will act before the Necromancer. Okay, let's pull in one of the hitmans. But then, uh, going for a subdue on the Necromancer. Not the zombie, the Necromancer. As the zombies will hit me in the face. Gremlin on the way. Okay, I guess healing is pointless now. If you don't want to deal with healing, uh, then you should uh, just uh, go and uh, kill the Grey Phoenix first, and actually research their stuff <laughs> because I didn't do that. Take out the hitman. When he died to poison? Yeah, he's dying to poison, at least. It's too slow. The necromancer is way too slow. This My also improves Verge's uh, chance to hit. Oh, stun it too. 94%. Yeah. Let's take the shot on the Hitman. And last, we got this Hitman guy. We're gonna capture him. He got captured. Oh, we got lightly wounded. Okay, then. City Anarchy. At one point, my City Anarchy was always, was almost uh, halfway through the bar, but yeah, I guess uh, it's not a problem. Blue Blood has completed spec up legwork. Woo! He missed, he missed some missions, like uh, like I uh, dealt with all the crime syndicates and save City Hall. But hey, you you never skip like day, Blue Blood. Respect. Let's see what we got. Hey, Blue Blood. Can you help me train? I need to test an adjustment on my shield. No, of fuck course. off. What are we doing? So, I need you to shoot me. No, no, man, I'm not gonna shoot you. It's the only way to field test my shield. Cherub, we have ballistic mannequins for this exact purpose. We do? Yeah, let's get one set up. Thanks, Blue Blood. Don't know what I'd do without you on the team. Probably get shot in the face. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we got 60 intel. Yeah, but you learn a lot by uh, going uh, for leg day. 
Okay, maybe we could go for more reg regen weaves. This this seemed like the, a good option. Oh, we got critical mission. Do we have critical missions all the time now? I think he should go on a mission now. Come on. He's, he never goes on a mission. He should really go on a mission. <laughs> Once. Well, the problem is that the snake can't learn anything, I think. Uh, no, no, no. Should we have the snake uh, getting some intel? I know it seems like an odd choice. Actually, it shouldn't be the snake. We should have uh, Cherub here doing the leg work. Like, like how he learned right now. And instead, we're gonna have Torque here helping with the research. That actually is completely unhelpful right now. And then we have uh, Blue Blood on the team. With his pistols. What? I know what no, I wasn't ready. The progeny, Grey Phoenix, Sacred Coil. Each group they backed was set up to fail. But with each running rampant, 3-1 PD would stretch thin enough to break. And who steps in? I don't know. Mercenaries. Shrike. Exactly. Fear was the point, and it would have worked if Chimera Squad hadn't pushed back. So they pushed back on City Hall. And if a government no longer exists, <laughs> you replace the government. But they were sloppy. The mercenaries were coordinated out of Ascension Tower. Atlas is in there? That was Advent's old headquarters. The place is a fortress. A fortress I want you inside. We need to hit Atlas before they realize they're burned. I have an idea on how to get in, but uh, the squad isn't going to like it. Brief them on the way. This can't wait. Wait, wait, wait. We never had an eye on Advent's old headquarters at all. Like, no one. Not even a fucking security camera. Not even uh, paying a hobo to, to, like, keep an eye on it. Like, every month or so. Not even that. Not even taking a piss at the wall. Like... Every uh, Christmas uh, gathering, when, once you get drunk uh, from like get, uh, hanging out too much with your family, not even that, not even that. I was like, wow, this Atlas guy is like, whoo, he's, 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 he's damn good. Oh, critical mission. I, I know, we, we're going there. I suppose we need to uh, gear up first, right? He's going for leg day. I guess we didn't have enough time to get everything. So technically I think it would be even better if you went for a team that has two type of weaponry. Because I didn't get the chance to upgrade uh, pretty basic stuff. And obviously I, I never had a chance to upgrade the shotguns. So... Ultimately, the, that, that's maybe the biggest thing. Just choosing your type of weaponry. You want to go with. Which is a little odd. That really shouldn't be the, the main deciding factor. At any rate. Take down Atlas. Guess what's going to happen next time. So, thanks for watching guys and see you next time.